We are a uh, social service nonprofit agency. We've been around for 127 years. Um, our department, the Career Service Department, is fairly, fairly focused on the professional job seeker in transition. Um, we offer career counseling and career coaching. We offer job search skills training. And we offer a way for you to find your career identity as you transition from one industry to another. Those of you that might be interested in opening up your own business, since entrepreneurship is the foundation of this country, not everybody has to work for somebody, we have something called the Duman Center, which helps people start their own business, or it helps small established businesses raise capital, uh, get capital, and has an access to um, uh, professionals and mentorship to help you be successful in a small business. So we are a kind of a full service agency um, with many facets and have been around for a very long time and we're proud to be in our third century. I I'm going to do a, just a really quick uh, introduction of my own personal experience transitioning from the corporate to the nonprofit world. I spent many years in advertising and marketing, I 25 years as a producer and I recently transition from the corporate world to nonprofit, and there is a difference. There is definitely a difference, but the skill sets needed, we hope, what we're going to find out tonight, are very similar to what is used in the corporate world. There's really only four questions every hiring manager is going to ask themselves about a job seeker. Can they do the job? And that has to do with skill set. Will they, will they do the job? That has to do with motivation. How will they fit into the team? Obviously, we know what that means. And my personal favorite is, can I stand being around this person eight hours a day? <laughs> and I think the fourth one and the third one probably trumps the first one and the second one. If you can't fit into the team, if you do have a personality problem or a behavior, if you're a problem child or behavior ch problem, um, you're not going to be hired. And so the soft skills that we teach at JVS, uh, besides the hard skills that you need, we feel are probably even more important than the, the skills and the stuff. That's what really uh, seals the deal on most hi with most hiring managers. Um, the one thing that I have learned is that the nonprofit world is certainly more accepting and more open to seasoned professionals. We know what those quotes mean. Um, I think many of us understand that the nonprofit world values experience. Certainly, we don't get paid probably as much as we do in the corporate world on a lot of levels, but the trade off is that experience really is valued, and uh, you don't necessarily have to compete with the 20 somethings for the mid and the upper level positions. We really do want people with experience that can bring a lot to the party. So, that's the real positive thing about the nonprofit world.